Hey everyone, Blade and Soul 2 is a new upcoming cross-platform MMORPG game which you will be able to play on mobile devices and on PC using Purple Emulator. Pre-registrations are open in Korea and I have prepared for you today all informations we have so far about this game and also I will show you what is Purple. Before we start, let me just say subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit that bell icon to see more MMORPG videos in the future. I am following all informations from beautiful world of MMORPG gaming and when I see something interesting is happening or if I see some useful informations, you will see that here on my YouTube channel. So make sure to subscribe. Okay, let's check first how is this new website looking and then I will share with you all informations about the game and Purple Emulator. So I'm here on official website of Blade and Soul 2 in Korea and I will put a link in the description below video so you can check it later for yourself. But let's see now how is this looking. Yeah, this is really beautiful what to say about the graphics, right? Let's check some titles uh, here. A complete breathtaking fantasy world. Imagine a beautiful utopia like a hand-painted oriental scroll come to life. Witness living legends and the mystical beginning of the mythical world. Really nice. Okay, let's see what is this. Windwalk around the adventure filled world. There is more than meets the eye. Discover the untold stories and travel to each corner of the vast world. Yeah, open world. Really amazing, right? It reminds a lot, of course, on Blade and Soul original game. There they are in the beginning, those who planted the seeds of Blade and Soul. Their past, present and future are about to grow further. So this is completely new storyline, we can say. Completely new game, but some basics, yeah, are from Blade and Soul. The dark blood running throughout my veins. Is it a blessing of curse? On the left side, on the right side, I feel someone's heart throughout the mystical energy that surrounds my body. Oh yeah, how this looks, really amazing, right? Graphics are really beautiful. It's just beautiful to watch this website. Imagine how gameplay will look. Ultimate action-packed battles. Fight alongside ancient heroes and wield powerful energy firing weapons. Experience realistic battle feedback and excitement in unrivaled martial arts action. Wow, right? Coming soon. Choose a weapon. And here we can see actually six uh, weapons. I will talk about the weapons a little bit later. We can see some icons here. A pinnacle of action like you have never experienced before. Feel your weapon's energy at your fingertips and let it resonate with the souls. Your new journey is about to begin in Blade and Soul 2. It looks really amazing, right? This is something, uh, yeah, really, really insane. What to say? Okay, let's check now some information about uh, this uh, new MMORPG game. Details regarding the game. So, Blade and Soul 2 is a brand new story using the same worldview as original Blade and Soul. As I said before, game will be released as cross-platform game which you will be able to play on mobile devices and on PC using special platform developed by NCSoft Purple. I will show you Purple later in the video. Blade and Soul 2 will not have classes. Okay, so this is interesting. No classes, characters class is determined by the weapon you are using. So this is something like uh, Albion Online over there, if you know that MMORPG game, also there is no classes, but depending on which weapon you are using, that will determine your character's class. Weapons which you will be able to use are axe, sword, bow, arrow, and some kind of ritual bell. At least uh, that I have recognized from that icons, it's hard to translate anything at this point, but uh, that icons are telling us that weapons will be, like I said, axe, sword, bow, arrow, and some kind of ritual bell. Game will have huge open world to explore, and some of the features of the game are world bosses, faction PvP, and raids. 
wow okay right this sounds amazing so huge open world world bosses faction pvp and raids come on what do you want more from mmorpg right so pre-registration is up over there in korea and i will show you here basically on this website you can pre-register if you pre-register you can get uh, some uh, pre-registration rewards this uh, costume you can see here real nice skins it's looking real nice and some other in-game items and uh, this on the end is some kind of in-game currency obviously looks like that these are some in-game potions or food i assume and uh, if you pre-register yeah if you can pre-register here as, as you can see you need to enter mobile phone number <laughs> everything is fine basically here i'm over 14 personal information uh, all agree everything looks good just not this uh, mobile korean phone number right this will be a problem but of course uh, we will try to get around that to play over there blade and soul so basically you can grab that pre-registration rewards and like i said before you can play this game also on pc using purple so here we have a purple download and let me show you before if you never heard about this this is a really important a purple is a platform developed by ncsoft basically it's a mobile emulator so you are able to play games which are usually on mobile devices you can play on pc Usually we were using emulators like uh, BlueStacks to play uh, some uh, mobile games on PC, but NCSoft have decided to build their own emulator Purple. Here we have Purple and I will put a link in the description below video, of course, so you can check uh, this emulator. You can already play, as you can see, Lineage here using uh, Purple. Yeah, this is something really cool, right? So. For all of you who were sad, same as me, because I was thinking we will not be able to play this game on PC. Good news, we will be able to play it on PC. This is really great news, I must say, because uh, check these graphics. I know that trailers and what we can see here on this website is always looking better than the actual gameplay, but come on, I have no doubt at all that Blade and Soul 2 will look amazing, absolutely amazing on mobile devices and on PC. Regarding release date, there is no news so far. It's coming soon. So yeah, if pre-registrations are open, that means that probably very, very soon this year, we will see release of the game. And so far, what we can do to wait some news regarding a release of the game and try to pre-register, of course, over there in Korea. It will not be easy, but maybe we can get around that because like you have seen, you need Korean mobile phone number, but uh, I assume that players, gaming community, which like to play MMORPG games will find a way. Anyway, if I see any kind of news regarding release date of Blade and Soul 2, or if I find some way to play over there Blade and Soul 2 in Korea, you will find out about that on my YouTube channel. Thank you for watching the video and subscribe to my YouTube channel to see more Blade and Soul 2 videos and of course other MMORPG gaming videos in the future. See you soon.